There are two containers X and Y. X contains 100 ml of milk and Y contains 100 ml of water. 20 ml of milk from X is transferred to Y. After mixing well, 20 ml of mixture Y is transferred back to X. If M denotes the proportion of milk in X and N denotes the proportion of water in Y, then which one of the following is correct? Now here, this let's say this is the vessel X and this is the container Y. So here initially we have 100 ml water and here we have sorry here we have 100 ml milk right in X we have 100 ml milk and in Y we have 100 ml water. Now then what happened was that we poured 20 ml of milk from X to Y. So what happens here now we have 80 ml of milk and here we have 100 ml water and also we have 20 ml of 100 ml of water and 20 ml of milk so now what happened in y is that totally 120 ml is there in that 100 ml is water and 20 ml is milk so from here in the third step 20 ml of mixture y is transferred to x so in if in 120 ml we have 20 ml of milk then in 20 ml of that mixture we will be having 20 divided by 6 right because 20 is 120 divided by 6 so if you are transferring 20 ml from vessel y to vessel x then 20 by 6 in that 20 ml 20 by 6 will be milk and rest will be water rest means 20 minus 20 by 6 so it will comes 100 by 6 so 100 by 6 will be water now we transferred back this to x now what happened in x how much will be there in x we have 80 milk and now we have 20 by 6 m we added so 20 by 6 so this is equal to 80 into 6 is 480 plus 500 by 6 ml of milk will be there and also in x we have 100 by 6 ml of water so this is the combination of x now in y y it was 100 ml of water right 100 ml of water but in from that 100 ml of 100 ml 100 by 6 ml of water is transferred to x so 100 minus 100 by 6 which is equal to 6 into 100 600 minus 500 by 6 ml of water will be there and also in y 20 ml of milk was there from that 20 ml 20 by 6 ml of milk is transferred back to x 20 by 6 which is equal to 100 by 6 milk so here the amount of the amount of uh, m, m denotes the proportion of milk in x though so the amount of milk in x is 500 by 6 and amount of water in y is again 500 by 6 ml so the proportion of milk in x is actually equal to the proportion of milk uh, water in y so option a m equal to n is the right answer